joined Jiu-Jitsu, he was focused on one thing, winning. As a 13-year-old, just at the foundation of the martial arts, he found it rather hard for it to let him to fool around the class. He hit the inevitable wall. But he did not give up when Jiu-Jitsu became difficult. He joined the Art Schwab Gym in Copenhagen to further develop his goals. Soon, Trans became very distinguished in the art, and he won the Rio Open Championship as a brown belt in 2010. Later that year, Trans won the Nogi Championship, the World Championship, and the European Championship. In 2011, Alexander Trans went on to win, win the World Pro, Pro Cup Trials Championship in Warsaw and in weight and absolute. Still, as a brown belt, he went on to triumph in the Pan American Championships and the World Championships. Along with these victories, Trans became an international hero. Alexander Trans began training three times a day to keep improving his skills. After a few more years of hard work and dedication to the art, Trans received his black belt from the hands of legendary Leo Vieira. Months later, Alexander Trans won the Pan American Championship for the second time as a Pesadismo, which is a weight class over 221 pounds. Currently, Trans has 31 wins with 18 wins by submission. Thank you. Also, I have cool facts. Okay, so his favorite position and technique is the deep half guard. He has five wins by knee guard, three wins by toe hold, two wins by choke from the back, four wins by arm bar, one win by choke, one win by foot lock, and two wins by other moves. Good stuff. Thank you, Alex. <laughs> Give him a round, guys. Give him a round.